Tucked away in the corner of a shopping centre, this is the bank that cyber criminals allegedly tried to take over. Their plan was breathtaking in its audacity and remarkably simple. Police issued a picture of a piece of technology similar to the one they say was used. The device was a KVM or keyboard video mouse which can be bought online for as little as £10. It allows data and contents on a computer's desktop to be transmitted to another computer. This would have enabled the suspects to effectively remotely take over the bank's computers and access their information. Police say their operation here was intelligence-led and time-critical. A series of raids were carried out at properties in West and Central London and at one in Slough. A total of 12 men were arrested. Santander said they were pleased the arrests had been made and explained that the attempt to fit the device to the computer in the Surrey Keys branch was undertaken by a bogus maintenance engineer pretending to be from a third party. No member of Santander staff was involved in this attempted fraud. We certainly see lots of internet activity, we see lots of mobile phone activity and customers are increasingly using these devices to, to access their accounts and therefore it is an area which banks in particular are focusing a lot of their attention on to prevent fraudulent activity and to prevent threats from materialising. The alleged fraud may have ultimately failed but banks will undoubtedly now look at what happened here to see if any lessons can be learned. Ender Brady, Sky News, South East London.